Hello, and welcome back to part 23 of my Total War Warhammer 2 Let's Play with the Cult of Sigma. We are going to prepare, to prepare for a war with Clan Mulder, and attempt to confederate Stirland as soon as it is possible. Well, if we could get our Imperial Authority up to here, we would just have to wait a few turns, which would be preferable. So let's hope that we can do that. Now, we're going to send this army... We're going to send this army up here. I said we're going to send this army up here to deal with... To help deal with that. Oh, okay, there she is. I'm not concerned about her. Not anymore. We're going to send Marcus Wolfhard up here to replenish a bit. Or perhaps we can send him straight to the Pox Marsh. Nah, it's perfect. Let's want to the fox march. No, we're gonna send him here to Gal's graveyard to replenish for a while and then up there. Now, this guy's still going up here to. No, this guy's going to go up here. Let us begin. We're gonna send both of our guild here. Bring me to my and next one, Karl Franz is going to destroy, is going to, to conquer King's Blade. We're going to give him points into boost income, so we make more money. We have nothing really to do here at the moment. So let's just check if everything has a commandment. Since this place can't really rebel, we're going to go with the uh, untainted one. And I'll see you after the end turn. Now, we're being attacked here by where Volkmar the Grim is, but since I can auto-resolve it, I do not intend on actually fighting this battle out myself, so... Okay, we lose two great swords. Oh, it's the Sons of Sigma uh, and two Flagellants. Easy to replace. We're going to need that money in order to replace them. Okay, we're back. The Empire. I shall be victorious. Let's get Dursu. Your order is dismissed. Goodbye, Dursu. Wait to freedom. Follow me. And Balthazar Gelt might as well do this, he has enough movement range. No peace. The war. He's going to get points into... Uh, Transmutate to lead. We're gonna give these guys... Fervors. And him I'll give Gutter Fighter. I'll finish off Gutter Fighter. And then we're gonna now we're gonna send uh, Ready. I am we're gonna send our friend Karl Franz up here. My are to move. So he can uh, so he can then go fight. The instrument of Sigmar's will. So he can go fight Clan Mulder. Grant me strength. Now let's recruit two flagellants and two great swords. And one more flagellant. Now this army here is going to recruit. We're going to recruit Yeah, a few spearmen, they have pretty decent male defense. Actually we're going to recruit two of Two Hellstorm rocket batteries and two Hellblaster Valiants and two Hellstorm rocket batteries. And then one Spearman every turn. Then we're also going to recruit a few hand. Uh, three handgunners and three 
three handgunners and three... No, two handgunners. Two handgunners and three crossbowmen. And the rest is going to be five more spearmen. Yeah, now we're going to continue following him. And upgrade that. We can upgrade that here because there's nothing else to upgrade. I will marshal the bed. And we're going to keep these regions here under control. We're going to stay here until this is built. And then move over to here and continue raising some territories. Okay, we can end our turn. Let's just set a commandment here. First of all, we want, we want growth and we want the host fest dark command. Commandment. I want some more income from here, that would help. I will the men. And I want our armies to continue going up here so they can go fight Clan Mulder. Where's Karl Franz? Okay, he is here. And he's gonna go up there to fight Klein Mulder. Yeah. See you after the end turn. So yeah, since he lost his last region, he's going to attack this place, but that's only gonna trap him here. Which is good for us. Okay, they did not attack us just yet, but we are at war with them. So let's continue making our way up here. If they attack us, it's not a big deal. Well, my army is good enough to deal with them. Mm, but if I don't have to attack them, I won't. Yes, my lord. To strengthen the empire. Let's attack them here and free our last and defeat Orion. To battle. You want this for this guy? For these guys? Yeah, like so. That's the end of Orion and the rest of the Wood Elves. Yes. Now we can get more points into... Fervent? Fervor? Stalk? Now, uh, Urana Thunderbolt. Oh, Ward of Sigma would help, actually. An Imperial Pegasus. And Route Marcher, because we want to get... Because we want to get all the way up here faster. True servant of Sigma. You want these guys because they have plenty of melee defense, which is useful. Now we have the... This is not... This is decent, but I think it's only for the Lord, so... Not too good of a Lord defeat trait. How should we proceed? We want to recover our salt. And improve that. Here at Vols Anvil, we'd like to put our income, our income, our growth. And later on, we'll have to build the Temple of Sigma. So. We want both of Zargeld to make his way up there as well. Here we can have more income. We can improve that here as well. One more turn and we can leave. To the provinces. Direct me. We could also then research this because this is plus one public order everywhere. I 
See you after the end turn. Okay, we're back. Still no events with... And still we have zero events to do with the... The, um, with whatever they're called. Sterland, I think. Yeah, we still have no events to improve Sterland. We want to improve public order here. Yeah, because it's quite low. So let's improve the castle. And actually go for host fest tag. Let's recruit three more spearmen. They're not the they're not supposed to be the damage dealers in this army anyway. What? This place has finished construction of most of its things. Yeah, now it has 15 due to characters, as 90 with the building, so yeah, we can. And it has a minus 13 due to corruption, but corruption's gonna wear off eventually. Ready. Raise Sigma. Yes. <laughs> the dwarves are fighting against. What do you want? The, I thought they were fighting against the world wa the world walkers. Guess not. We can continue making our way up here with this army. We'll continue. We can continue our ma making our way up there, and we could then fight. I'd still don't if we can't confederate them. Um, and that would then be victory for us. But first we need to get rid of Clan Mulder. So once we're rid of, so once we're done getting rid of Clan Mulder, then we will fight them if we have no other option. What does the Emperor bid? I would prefer us not having to fight them, but if we have to fight them, we will fight them. Now let's get our army in here. Very well. On to land. And have Marcus them replenish for a few turns. They'll, they'll be replenishing for four turns and then they'll go down here. See you after the end turn. We are back and we get another event, but unfortunately it is with Wissenland and not with the ones I actually want. Yeah, but we have enough Imperial Authority. Boris Todbringer's gone insane. I don't really care. This will bolster the nation. Yes, my lord. He's just here to You want to raise as many territories as we can. We can improve our replenishment. We can improve his uh, shield of faith. And get soul blight. It would take another eight turns to build, but it would help if it got. But if this would help if it got um, leveled up. Corruption is is slowly falling. We can stop. Taxing it for a while. Yes, General. Throg is up there with an army. Not a very good army, but it is an army. You want to maybe try and assault units? I'll ignore that. I think you may have failed. Yeah, he failed. That's not good. Let's bring Volkmar the Grim over here via water. The nation calls. The nation calls. Protector of the weak. Now where is the uh, okay, Mars Light still some way away?
Kislev is currently not that well protected. Your orders. Your orders. Seek out the heretics. We do not have the money to actually do anything, so we're going to declare war on Clan Mulder next turn. I command here. They managed to sort of catch up to each other, I don't know how. I really want to confederate him though still and though, but it's taking for but it's taking forever before we get an an actual chance to do so. If we send everyone up here, we can take over Clan Mulder very quickly. Favorable wins, finally. When something's gonna help him get there faster. Yeah, now he's gonna get there very fast. That's what we want. Earth blood. So next turn we we'll declare war on them. I'll see you after the end turn. Okay, we are back. Throg is raiding us with his army. It's not a very good one, but let's bring Volkmar the Grim over here so he can help fend it off. His army should be able to defeat it if he has to. He has a decent enough wizard, a good battle priest. Tenacity. That helps him survive. At the next level. No, no. Bring him up here. Now, how long until our armies are near where they should be? By the comet. Move. Kis he's close to Kislev. Balthazar Gelt is also on his way. Pick up the pace. There's not much we can build here anymore. No, I will not be compelled. What is he complaining about at the moment? I am ready. Are you? He has to use every bit of movement he has. Bring me to my men. Yes, general. Let's try to wound this guy. That worked. Try and wound him. We actually, yeah, we wounded him. Send him up here. I will marshal the men. War calls. Destroy that. The garling loot. To war! It is for the best. He is level 20, so he can get his Imperial Griffin. He's a legendary lord, so he's already mortal. Wild eyed. And boost income, or preferably scouting. We can we could do with it a few new magic weapons. A light college accolade. Yeah, that would, all, that would help cleanse the corruption of this location a little bit faster. By Sigma. He is close. Forward. In his name. Scott veteran. I want them all to be tanks before they are war before they are actually good at doing damage. And I would like to declare war on them. 
Both of these guys are reliable at the moment, so... Yeah, everyone declared war on them. Protector of the weak. Now we, we lose one of every single in contract if you you stay. This would bring this guy back, but this is the wrong electric I think it would bring this electric card back. And I don't want to br steel. But I don't want him back. Servant of the faith. So since I don't want that electric count to return. And it is preferable that I don't do anything with that. Sigma so soon we'll be able to deal with that. How is Marcus doing? Marcus Wolfhart. Still replenishing. See you after the end turn. Okay, we're back and we can get some Imperial Authority, so yeah, we'd like to have some more Imperial Authority. We are researching something that might help us in those locations where we shouldn't be building. We have the Age of Peace. If we go in here like that. Get out! True servant of Sigma. If I bring this guy over to here, we would probably be able to attack him together. Praise be to Sigma. I will marshal the men. Also, we're going to need to bring quite a few armies over if we want to stop him there. Imperial Pegasus. I forgot about Nicholas Pappenheimer here. Let's bring him over here as well. We're going to need to take over this location here. That's also going to have to belong to us. But since it's now the Age of Peace, the uh, Shield of Civilization thing doesn't apply anymore, so I'm a little bit scared that the Dwarves might start a, a second War of the Beard, which would be really bad. Moving off. Let's bring these guys over to Kislev. Yes. Moving off. And here, so they can then take over the rest of the land. Champion of the faith. We want Emperor's Finest. It's going to help us if these guys attack. I don't have any problems, Throg. Look, you have a lot of problems, though. You're a weird troll that constantly regenerates and is horribly mutated. You're the one with less problems. This place can rebound four turns. Luckily, there's also no more chaos corruption being spread because, as it's now the Age of Peace. So there's no more chaos corruption. Yeah, all the chaos corruption is going to wear off very soon. Which I find to be very positive. Has Marcus recovered? Decently enough. Okay, he always loses at least one of his mortars. Next time he'll claim the Pox Marsh and be on his way to claim the Awakening. Because if we get all those things, we might be able to complete the game a little bit sooner. Because, well, we're basically only missing Sterland and the Wasteland. And that's because, well, Sterland controls part of the Wasteland. So we're going to have to wait, so we're going to try and kick Clan Mulder out of here. And if we can do that, that'll be very good for us. Okay, we're back. Clan Mulder is attacking us there. 
Grand Theogenist. Throg is still there, however. Warrior of Sigma. I serve the Helden Hammer. Let's trap him so that he can't escape. What? Pick up the pace. You want to recover in here for a while? Sigmarite Arch Lector. I think that if we bring this guy over here, I serve the Helden Hammer. For the Emperor! Yeah, if I bring him over here, I think I can initiate the attack. Hmm. Now, this army is pretty good, actually. These guys aren't the best units, but if he uses them correctly, he can do quite a lot of damage to us. Not everyone in this army is immortal. In fact, quite a. F in fact, I think it's only the wizard that is. Our front line is pretty decent. We have a Hellstorm rocket battery. You, you bet few ways of actually dealing with these guys. Let's quick save just in case this goes wrong and try to. K uh, we need to kill this front their front line, but we have magic for that, and so most of these guys are not wearing all that much. Okay, yeah. yeah, three of them are not wearing much armor and the other two are, so piercing bolts of burning should do good on them. Yeah, this army should be able to beat them. I don't know why he recruits so much of these cavalry. They're not a good they're not very good, but if I mismanage my units they can get in behind. It mean cause me a lot of trouble, so let's try to use our units correctly. Getting rid of Throg here would help. Up tremendously. Okay, so we have a few problems. Let's get let's get the Sunmaker up to here. Adjusting elevation. These guys should help. Yes, sir. The tank should be around here. Okay, Only let's go back a little command. bit. Probably it should help. Probably a better idea if we went back a little bit. Hand gunners. Now we should stay here, this way. Group up. Put this guy in the second group. Have this guy here to def help defend. For the twin or like, these guys here. They can defend the cannons. At your service. Standing by. We have enough wins of magic at the moment. Outriders. These outriders are... Not as fast as the horse masters are, so the horse masters can actually catch up to them. But let's see if we can quickly deal some damage to those guys before the battle actually starts. I speak, you act. Okay, this guy will be removed from the group. So group 2 is going to move forward. Yeah, this way we can then move forward. Put this in group 2. Okay. Let's start. It'll be a priority to focus fire on Throg, because he's powerful. We caught, we caught him up in Raging Suns. Shoot those guys, please. At speed. Okay, you guys over to here, maybe. Position. Yes, sir. Quickly. Ready. Tank position. It would be good to have this head. So I maybe shoot them. Be important if we shot down something like that. Okay, yeah, go forward. Where's our witch hunter?
piercing bolts of burning here would help. So top here. Okay, where is Throg? There is Throg. Let's drop an accusation on Throg so that he dies quickly. These guys are the not so armored variety, so that should help clear them out a bit. Yeah, that should clear them out. That's Throg gone. Good. Black lines there. Go take care of them there. We serve the Emperor! Hellblast of Volleygon! Hellblast of Volleygon. Okay, yeah, black lines, shoot them there. By Strike them down. Winning, that's good. Okay, yeah, this army just counters that one, one perfectly well. Did we use accusation on Throg? I don't remember. Having to kill them. Okay, have them quickly charge into those guys so they don't. Those skin wolves, they have to be stopped. Okay, those guys have replenished. Not replenished, they have recovered, but now it's the army loss penalty, so we win. Yeah, this was an easy fight. Marauder horse masters aren't good against this army. Too much firepower. Our pyromancer did good. Let's see if this, if this burning... This burning head can hit someone. Mm, it might hit those guys. No, it didn't actually kill anyone. So now we, th so now I think we can pursue and wipe out the rest of them. Our flatulence did a lot of damage. Black lines did good. And we managed to kill Throg, which was probably the most powerful unit they had. We can sell them for some income, but we don't need that. Champion of the faith. Volkmar the Grim. Yeah, now we have the Troll Hunter ability. Now this army isn't dangerous even if they catch us off guard during an ambush. They just don't have enough units in that army to pose as much of a threat. Not without warp bombs, at least. True servant of Sigma. For the Emperor! By the Heldenhammer. But let's just bring... Let's just bring Volkmar over since he is the one with the strongest army. Warrior of Sigma. My sight off can go to Norden. Pappenheimer can continue his way up here. To battle. Do not waste my potential. Geld can Very conquer well, this place. I will do this. Bring me to my men. Will. We get a sort of anti-heroes, that's good, we can give it to someone. Let's go. Let's see here. Who would do well with a sort of anti-heroes? I think it would be. Volkmar. This guy already has something. Champion of the faith. Here to serve. I think he might. 
Yeah, that would help out. Uh, nothing here we can give him, so boost the uh, income would help. All the line would be useful. And that's about it. The righteous hammer. Preemptive strike. Your orders? Improve assault garrison because we're going to have to use that on help it because that's one hell of a garrison and uh, the problem is the walls obviously I... if Kadazakarak can claim help it I don't care as long as Van Mulder stops existing we have so many things to skip past uh, yeah I'd like to research the princess emissary to the princess of Altdorf Okay, can't fight that. Can't fight all of that at once. Maybe when they're gone. Because that's for just way too many doom wheels for me. These guys I can. De these guys I can deal with. This isn't probably defeating before they get to us, but yeah, that's just too many doom wheels for me. Okay, we are back, and uh, the Skaven put a plague on this location so I can't actually go here and do anything at the moment. This no. army is plagued, I hope that fighting it doesn't cause us to suffer from the plague as well. Oh no, but Volkmar the Grim caught the plague, that's... That's not good, that's not good. This How long does the plague last? I have no idea. So now he can't fight. If I go there, I just spread the plague, so... Hunting. He's basically going to have to advance suffering from the plague. Which is going to be extremely annoying. Nothing you can't actually deal with, it's just annoying. I will cast out all evil. Let's see, how, how many turns does that last? Five turns before the plague wears off. Yeah, how annoying. Awaiting orders. I hope we didn't cut, I hope this, is, this doesn't give us the plague. Ever on I will go. I serve the Heldenhammer. Following Sigmar's path. Forward. Okay, in we're not name. close enough to actually go in there, so that's a problem. One point to honest steel would help. Okay, this army is not in the best of shape, but uh, if they get attacked by those guys, I'm certain we can survive. I mean, yeah, the, all they have is a f one dangerous unit, but we can burn. These two units are dangerous. This thing is dangerous, but we have uh, we have decent uh, we have cavalry and generals that can take care of that. No, you failed, failed. The Empire. What does the Emperor bid? Let's bring this guy over here. I command here. Uh, the army is in bad shape. My right by Sigmar's crown. Sir. See if they have an army there. Who calls? Yes, General. They have a fortress, but not an army. Ah. 
Oh look, it's the Slayer King, Ungrim Iron Fist. So let's bring him over to here. Yes. And we're gonna keep Balthazar Gelt. We're gonna bring him here in to more time uh, in case we need to fight a war against Sterling. So? We should probably also bring Pappenheimer over there. Actually, Pappenheimer can, can stay here to, to fight him. Because a war with those guys might be inevitable. It would also be a very fast way of ending the game, so... Much faster than having to wait like 400 turns before they decide that we can confederate. I will marshal the men. So let's bring Balthazar Gelt here so he can start taking over the region of Stirland if it ha if it becomes necessary. I'm going to improve that. I'm going to improve that. The nation calls. Is there any military presence in there? No, it doesn't say I'm military presence at the moment, so... Okay, if they leave, we can take it over. Okay, if they're gone, we can take over. We want more points into that. Both of our can get final transmutation improvements. Counter strike. Nothing we can get this guy that actually matters, so. How should we proceed? See after the end turn. Okay, we are back. This guy has attrition a bit. I will do anything for Sigma. Death to the faith. Let's get rid of these guys. The council is disappointed. I will marshal the men. And he runs straight into <laughs> the path of our of our lovely little lunatic Boris Todbringer. It seems we might have to fight this one out ourselves. Outside of the play claw catapult, there isn't much that's gonna cause us any damage, so let's go. Then we're gonna have to bring these two armies back somewhere where they can actually replenish. And from there on. And now we wait for for Volkmar to uh, stop being afflicted by the plague. Now I know for a fact that the plague clock catapult outranges our mortars. Mortar! Yeah, they yeah they, they only have three. Yeah, they have 380 range and it has has 400 range. So we will will be able to actually hit it from here, but. Yeah, maybe if we go with all cavalry units here, we can overwhelm them. The will. Especially if this guy charges with them. Great swords. By Ulrich's wrath. That's enough. Wise counsel. They can go attack. And these guys can go charging. Now we'd like to shoot those guys with our mortar. This is this is going to reduce their melee attack. Sigma calls. Attack! Great swords. Our cavalry Shield is about to charge in. in the Knights of the Everlasting Light. Comet. Yeah, they reduce melee attack with their aura. Their lances gleam with such lumin with luminosity that the foe cannot see to adequately defend themselves against the attack. Large devastating charge. Neat. The Empire endures. We are sick of 
He doesn't have much melee defense left because he's insane, but he does have plenty of melee attack. If they all crowd around him. Him all the better. Let's send a few. Let's send a bunch of Skaven into an unending hellhole called the pit, called uh, the Purple Sun of Zeres. They don't deserve anything better than that. So there we go. Uh, there's a, uh, that's a lot of these games that will never see, but never see the light of day again. Nor will they ever experience peace in death. They will just experience pain, misery, and horror. Spirits invoked. No! This took a little bit of damage. The Empire is yours. Demigrif knights. Okay, let's wait for us to have a little bit more winds of magic before we cast our new spell. How are our units doing? Our cavalry is doing fine. Ready to smite. General! Now Lingring! We serve the Emperor! Now! Here, Sigma's ears! Get them! By Sigma, obey me! Great sword! Okay, there we go. Let's use this so we Oh. Oh well now we need to wait 30 seconds. I'm sure that's not going to backfire on us. Zap, zap, good, good. Okay. No, no. Zap, zap, bad, bad. Zap, zap, very bad. Even though there was a lot of anti logins there, our cavalry managed to actually overpower them. Okay, there we go. Sent more of them to the purple son of Zarius. There we go. The purple son of Zarius dooms people. It dooms people to an eternity of pain and misery. Which is a lot worse than the Pit of Shades, which is just boredom. And you, and you can actually die in the Pit of Shades, so the Pit of Shades is a lot better. I mean, none of, none of them are good ways to die, but that one's infinitely worse. So we managed to overpower the anti-large units, and one on this side. And I think we barely lost anyone. I mean, our heroes are pretty wounded, but other than that, I think we're doing fine. Death wizards are really messed up, aren't they? Well. The army gets wiped out because he retreated once before, so... There we go. Our cavalry did well. Their play clock had pulled did decently well, but our artillery did better. They should have had some better artillery large instead of any. We're gonna execute him. No, Volkmar is still suffering from the plague. Not possible. Possible. It's bet if he takes us over, he will spread the plague there, so it's best if we just raise it. It's better that we just raise it. Because that way we don't spread the plague. Basic armor, we want a Helm of Discord, because those are very useful. Yes, General. We can give the Skylight College Accolade, so we can help cleanse the land. What? Accolade, I mean. 
we could get some more defenses for Volkmar so he can defend himself a little bit better. And we'll end our last turn. Sir. Salt units here. Insults to haunt rat. Rat. He failed, but that army is not a threat to anyone. Bring me to my men. Now this is a capital building, so it has a pretty powerful army. Summon the elector counts. I trust no man. Don't damage walls. I don't agree. He failed somehow. Your he orders? was. It was Dying really unlikely for him to fail, but he managed to somehow fail. He lets a, he gets a light college acolyte yes. out of it though, so that's good. Damage walls. How should we proceed? Take them before they get to battle. He succeeds. They're damaged, but those walls are I just too strong. So they let's. Uh, those walls are far too strong for me to try and deal with. So. Attack! Yeah, they are slightly wounded, and I suppose they might try and attack us. If they do, and it's not a not an ambush battle, they will be able to su survive. But peace, just war. that's something for the next episode, because I think we're going to end our episode here then. And I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, leave a comment, what does the and subscribe be? for more. If you did not like it, you can leave a dislike and... The information on ways I could and give me some information on ways I could improve. As always, it's end. I'll see you all next time. Farewell.